Pop Pops Bees. I'm give out, folks. So, I set my goals too high for the day, but there's 50 hives put together. There's 10 in each stack. There's three on the inside. Ah, uh, let's see. I managed to get the side handles cut on all 50 of these. So that was another 100 cuts. I had the rabbit joint uh, 50 boards this morning. So that was three cuts on each board. So that was another 150 cuts that I didn't count on making today. So I, got, I did get that done. I have had questions about the knot holes. This is rough cut lumber. You get what you get. I mean, there's some gorgeous boxes there. And yes, there's some with knots. If uh, you want, don't want imperfections, use something other than wood. Buy you some of them plastic beehives because woods are going to have imperfections in it. For what these boxes cost me a piece, to heck with the knot. We seal these. So I've, I've put tight bond three waterproof glue over them and then they'll all be painted. So for all the naysayers out there and the people that just like to try to stir a mess, there you go. I was asked why I put ratchet straps around these and I left another point about that out that I thought somebody might find it useful. So I've got these cut in stacks of 50. So a front, which is rabbited front and rear, and then two sides, there's enough wood there to make 25 hives, okay? Ratchet strap them together to keep, you know, from bowing until I get around to putting them together. But also, we're assembling over here. Okay, so I mean, it's not a lot of steps, but when you're working 14 hours, it, it is a lot of steps. So I can take my hand truck there, come over here, take this stack, pick it up, and carry it over there to the bench where I'm working at. So I just got to reach over and grab a board. So, you know, these are, I can move these jokers around. I can lean them, do whatever I need to to them, move them, whatever. So that's, that's another reason why we ratchet strap them. So handles are cut, got another 50 boxes to put together tomorrow and cut the short side handles. The handle jig, you can, you've got to put a spacer in here for those that hadn't seen it to do the short side. So I do all the, all the, I'm sorry, do the front and the back. The short, the, the sides are long, so you're running it without the spacer in it. So I cut all of those and then I'll go back and cut the fronts and the backs. So I figured I'd do that. I got bored putting boxes together and needed something else. So when I took a break, I started cutting handles. That's how you get ahead. You take a break, you just do something else. You don't stop. So sun's gone down. It was down when I come out. It's down when I'm going in. Heater's stopped up. Temperature's coming back up on it. So maybe it won't be so bad to get it warm in here in the morning. Little man and I are going in the house with my Mountain Dew. I'm going to get him bathed in dinner and time for bed. Good evening from Pop Pop's Bees. Y'all have a good night. Please like, subscribe. If you got any questions, ask them. I'll try to answer them the best I can. I'm not a carpenter, but they don't look too shabby. Y'all have a good night.